Hi, Master Chef Junior. Right now, I'm going to show you how to make my delicious homemade cupcakes. First, let's start with the super cupcake batter. Eight ounces of butter. Can I get those in? Then I'm going to put it onto medium speed. Isn't it? 
There we go. Now I will let my cocoa stir in the mixer for one minute and then I will be ready to put in my cupcake tray. Now I'll put my chocolate batter into the forms. Now on my last two, it's smelling great. I can't wait to cook these and eat these. After this, I'm gonna hit them on the table so that all the air bubbles will come out. I'm gonna go from a higher point so it lands there. Cut off the edges. Push it down. And a bit more. You don't want too much, otherwise when you cook it, it's going to rise way up. Last cupcake holder. And a bit more. Cut off the edge. And down. It looks so relaxing and soothing when I do that. They're all done. Now that all the batter is in the forms, I'm going to tap it one time to get all the air bubbles out. It's ready to go in the oven. I preheated it at 350. My cupcakes have been in the oven for 18 minutes. It smells so good in here and they look perfect. That goodness. I'm ready to make my frosting. First, I'm going to add 12 ounces of butter. And I'm going to put it on medium speed and leave it for 8 minutes. Butter's ready and it's pale in color. It's time to add the sugar. I'm gonna put it on close to the like that, and I'm gonna start adding it. The secret is to add it in one spoon at a time.
mixed together, it's time to add milk and vanilla. The milk will help enlighten it up. It's three tablespoons. to my icing to make chocolate icing. starting with the chocolate. Wow, it's nice and creamy, not too hard, not too soft, just right. I'm going to put it in and I'm going to squeeze it and pull it out like that. Open it and keep on doing it. This smells great. It looks so delicious. I'm going to push those in to make space for more. And I'm going to put that spoon just a bit more. There we go. This is going to go great on my chocolate cupcakes. Now that all the frosting has gone into the piping bags, I've already frosted one, as you can see. Isn't it beautiful? I put lemon zest on top. It's great for springtime. It got that fresh taste. Now I'm going to decorate this one. I'm going to put this blackberry on top. And some minter. Beautiful, isn't it? Now I'm going to do this one. This time I'm going to put in a strawberry. I love strawberries. So this is probably going to be my favorite cupcake. Beautiful. Ah, smells delicious. filled my piping bag with buttercream so I can cover all of these free cupcakes. This round is all sprinkles, no more fruit.
and I'm going to add in beautiful blue sprinkles. That reminds me of the sky for spring. That's beautiful. Now I'm going to do this one. This is going to be a pink sprinkled one. Beautiful daisies. And tip. I love spring coals, they're my favorite. Now I'm going to do the chocolate one. Now to add these on. There we go. Here are my three spring cold vanilla ones. Now I'm done with all of these vanillas. all the vanilla cupcakes and I'm starting with the chocolate. I love chocolate when I'm having hot chocolate because it goes chocolate, 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 chocolate. I have a strawberry chocolate cupcake. Now I'll decorate this cupcake. Beautiful. Now I'm going to go on to this cupcake. I love star sprinkles because they're so colorful, just like the rainbow. It's like a rainbow. Instead of like the streak link rainbows, it's stars in the sky, so it's a rainbow. Beautiful. I love some of my sweet chocolate chips.
These are like pearls under the sea, touching the sand floor. It's so relaxing. Or seashells touching the sand floor. More pearls coming out of the clams, like the clams are already opened. That would be beautiful, just imagining it. I love the beach. And the next one is a butterscotch on chocolate. I love butterscotch. It tastes like chocolate and caramel. Smells great together. Can put some there, there. One there. And one there. One there. In there. Here are all my beautiful chocolate cupcakes. And I'm going to say which one is my favorite is the strawberry one because it's got that fresh, juicy taste and it has that chocolate sweet taste with the, the great fluffiness under it. All 12 of these beautiful cupcakes are uniquely decorated. I usually love doing this. I get the cupcake and I put these in the beautiful silver crown. This cupcake is officially crowned Cupcake Queen by Alina Agamirza. Thank you for watching how I make delicious cupcakes. Have a sweet day.